Hello and welcome to Alert Chospashua. On today's uh, video, we are going to be looking at quick guide to convert webnet system on software. We've been on the surface software trying to get some of the quick things we could achieve from software. So today we're going to be looking at this quickly. So to do that, first you need to uh, import the coordinate you want to com uh, convert. But to do that also, there are a few ways of bringing in that coordinate in. Uh, first and foremost, there are three ways into which you're going to bring in your worksheet first. That is on the previous version. So I'm going to do the previous version and show you this version 25 where how it does. Okay. So one of it to bring our works uh, sheet is to click on file and then you go to new and then you have worksheet. So I will have the worksheet here. Another one is to press Ctrl W on your keyboard. You will see the worksheet just comes in. And then the last one where we come up here and then you see new worksheet. So we click on it. Worksheet will come in. So after this worksheet come in, you're going to see where there is open data. Okay, so once you click on this open data, it's going to now take you to bring in your data. So it has bring me to a favorite that I'm using. So we already have topo data here. So I just click on this and say open. So it's going to import here. But then on this version 25, this you, there's another new update to it that we could easily do. Instead of bringing a work a space, a worksheet, sorry, and uh, any of those things, what we'll do now is you still come up here, we're going to see open data file. So once you click on this open data file, it's taking you straight to bring in your Excel file that we save as CSV. So once I click on open, it's going to open a worksheet with the coordinate I am bringing in. All right, so because we've been able to see how to do that on where and on where, right? So now what is next is uh, first to convert this coordinate from Eastern to, that is from UTM to, um, um, from UTM to uh, geographic coordinate system. That's, that's my degrees. So I'm going to click on new projector coordinates. Now it's going to bring it like that. So automatically the coordinate system of this has been um, uh, the Eastern, the best, the mean UTM zone tattoo because this is Amad Bello University is area. So uh, our column A here is where our Eastern is. So I'm going to change this to column A and our column B is our Northern. So the coordinate source is, uh, the source coordinate is uh, UTM mean uh, zone 32. And then where this next one is where our converter will be, will be K. Uh, well, K is to file, let's use E since E is free. So we're going to use E and we're going to use F. So it's already on uh, MENA Nigeria, which is already a uh, geographic coordinates sorry yeah the web coordinates so if you don't know how to change it you click on this three dot here and then you come up to you come up to geographic coordinate system and then you locate Nigeria and then you locate Mina. Alright so that's it for this and then you hit OK. So once you hit OK we're going to have your coordinates converted to uh decimal degrees so both eastern and northern and decimal degrees are accepted on uh on actually it's only decimal decimal minute and second but degree minute and second that are not accepted so if you have coordinate that are on decimal degree minute seconds that you want to convert because you want to use an actually you could just click on this uh dms to uh all of that so let's say here um rev degree so these are basically we don't have any decimal degrees here we have the degree many seconds here so but i'm just going to explain that so once you have a coordinate on decimal degree minute seconds sorry you come here and then you select do the same thing and you are going to have it converted so you can convert as many coordinates as possible in their thousands in their millions this will so save you from problem of doing one one conversion so if you don't want to save this directly you can just come down just highlight the whole of this coordinate they are quite many you highlight all of it 
and uh, we're going to copy it and we paste it on Excel. So I have over 345 coordinates. So I'm just going to copy and then I'm going to open Excel. And I'm going to paste it there. Then can now use it on ArcGIS. So basically, this is what we can achieve. First, I say you have to import your workspace if you're using the lower version of uh, the software. Secondly, you have to. So here it will now be long and large and large. So we have if you are having. So I have pasted it. So let's delete this so that we have. So now this is the coordinate we've converted from eastern and northern to Basma degrees, and then we can save this as CSV. Now we we'll name it as converted, since we just converted it, and then we save. So a recap of the class, what have we achieved? We are able to achieve how to import Excel file into the software, either by the previous software or the current version of the software that you can just move straight to bringing it. The previous one, we have to open uh, a worksheet, but this one, you just go through and then to bring in both the worksheet and uh, the coordinate. And then we've gone to uh, assign a new coordinate to it, and then we're able to convert this. So basically this is where we want to bring to you today and don't forget to subscribe like share and comment on this video so that we could know exactly what you've learned from it and then we can also make improvement on it thank you and i will see you in the next video coming up shortly